My name is Philip Brindlehart. The uh, name of my business is Dark Moon Transport out of Lindenville, Vermont. I bought this truck out of Oklahoma back in August of 2018. Um, it looked completely different and slowly been plugging away at it. It's kind of a memorial thing for my mom. She passed away about a year before I bought the truck. It's the first one I've owned. Uh, before this, I was a company driver. Uh, I started driving in 2011. Put a, put a new bumper on. I think this is my second bumper. The other one was a 20 inch drop. I went to the moose bumper. The first load that I did with this after the body shop, I was running across New York about 20 after four in the morning and hit a deer at 65 miles an hour. So I was pretty glad I had this bumper on. I've done the grill. It's a Jones Hood A model style. It's got a 2WS cat, 18 speed fuller. I've done the RLK visor got over 200 lights on this. Originally, the whole truck was maroon and the fenders were a dark gray. It looked okay for what it was, but I figured if I'm gonna do the whole truck, I might as well do something special and something kind of cool. But on the A model style of the hood, um, the top of it flares out and I did it to match the stripes on the side of the truck. Spare time fab shop, they uh, made all brand new button tuck for me. I have a wooden console it took me three years to find that. I had a new top made for it. In the sleeper, there was a cabinet place back in Vermont that I used, and they pulled, they made uh, two brand new dresser drawers out of curly maple. Uh, they did a nightstand out of curly maple, boarded it in mahogany, and I have two upper compartments that were open, and the uh, used curly maple, made two doors for that. I put two six by nine speakers, one in each door. Those are minimizer fenders. Originally, it just came with quarter fenders, Hodge built. Um, I didn't really care for the quarter fenders. And uh, being up in Vermont, dirt roads and stuff, I needed a little bit more protection on the back of the sleeper, so I went with full wrap fenders. Um, I like them, they work good. I have a generator on the other side as an APU, and then I have it plumbed into my sleeper, and I have a two outlet, like a regular house outlet. And that's how I get my power inside.